لقب بروسلی افغانستان بخود دارم Afghanistan is not is not a good place is not a good country قبل از یک آباز به شهرت برسد که نه افغانستان تنها جنگ نیست میتونه بهترین قهرمان را داشته باشه دوستای مکتب در کوچه همسایه هدف من فقط ورزش ورزش راه را برای من نشان دادم میکنم پیش هفتم میتونه که مثل بروسلی چینی بری سال یک نفر یک بشری بروسلی بر آماده باعث از این میشه که دوباره بروسلی در سه سینما برگرده یا در ورزش Say you better watch Joe Frazier. He's awful strong. I said tell him to try band roll on. So I'm in office now. I'm the heavyweight champion of the world, and I don't have to talk no more and say I'm the greatest because people tell me I'm the greatest.张清标今年十八岁然后为什么会来到这里练舞呢是因为我觉得想要保护好别人首先要强大自己少林娥坡五月这是我们学校的名字没有男人以前在家的时候参与一些家庭人员所以我来我觉得能来到这里觉得是很幸福的一件事情早上今天上午大家们都在训练然后呢这边是住宿楼这里的小朋友大多都三岁至六岁非常的就是非常的小对他们就是苗子祖国未来的
Dozens of underground fights are organized every weekend. Ultraviolent sports have become a social phenomenon the world over. In the United States, it's free fighting, where all blows are allowed. The fighters are superstars, and their exploits are televised on the largest channels in the United States. The sport brings in more than 500 million in profits. I put down 5,000 on this fight, and I don't regret it. Free fighting is illegal. Organizing these types of gatherings has become a shadow economy. Illegal fighting gives him a way to earn some easy money without resorting to crime. Wrestling is the Knight family's only source of income, and their youngest daughter, Soraya, pulls the biggest crimes. She is the star. Soraya and Zach have been invited to attend trials for the giant American wrestling company. Being in the biggest federation in the world. Amazing. Soraya was signed on the spot, but Zach's been told he's out of shape. His little sister that didn't really give a shit about wrestling has become this sensation. I think I'd hold the record actually for like first 18 year old English girl to be signed. I sit there sometimes, I think, you little bitch. You know, you've done it. You've, you've actually done it. Muhammad Ali's first touch at international fame was becoming a gold medal Olympian in the 1960 Olympics in Rome. His style was quite different to other, other amateurs. He was very fluent. His amateur record was 100 wins with only five losses. By late 1963, Clay was the contender for Sonny Liston's world title. And Ali was, I, I, I think Liston was absolutely scared of him. He would call Muhammad, Muhammad Ali, who kept calling him Cassius Clay. His slave name. And Muhammad said, I want to kill him. And he gave young people the guts to come out against the war. You my enemy. My enemy is the white people, not Vietnam or Chinese or Japanese. Only last week, I murdered a rock. Angela Stone hospitalized a brick. I'm so mean, I make medicine sick. And we just came to life. Boop, 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 boop. I started now to, to drink and smoke and where I start now to in, be involved with another guy is the criminals, the outside. Uh, I was unemployed and so forth. I left school maybe at primary school and then we said that okay it's fine because we believe that if a person is educated he will not commit crime that is. to teach and I want to become a professional boxer. Why should you teach boxing at the prison? Because you learn them to fight. By my experiences in South Africa, one of the biggest things I've learned is that you cannot judge someone by the way they look. Some of them look real tough, but I do believe they are all human and they are all here for a reason. Don't waste your time you know, and activity and smoking and doing all of these things. You spend your time in sport, one day you will achieve something. Get ready for the next world war. Cinemas all over the world. As a viewing experience in movie theater, it was really, really something. <laughs>